XRP, we start with one of our charges. I want to give a quick update. If you refer to our analysis, since the price was within here, we mentioned if you get any reversal, we, I mean, any opportunity for buy, we will take it. And as we can see, still we have a divergence. We mentioned either we put over in trade above here or here, or we look for the reversal as a sharp move. Like right now, we're looking at this one. Any trade for buy from here, we will take it. And for those traders, they had in trade above here, the price tag, because we mentioned with, uh, I mean, if they still, they keep the trade, they should know how to manage it. The best things they take out the trade and they look for the next opportunity, all right? And right now we're looking at this one. With the breakout, it's a stop loss somewhere below this. If you get any opportunity for buy, we will take it. And with the breakout of 1.1, we can look for 1.13 for in by 1.16, all right? That's mean if you get any opportunity for buy, we will take it. This is what we have been looking for. And even we discussed based on forward chart. Right now we're looking for the reversal. And based on forward chart, we don't have any trades at top. The only thing is we want to see whether we can get the trade based on one hour chart, either from here. And right now I'm looking at this. Or we put our entry above here in case the price reverses as a sharp move. All right. And if I move to daily chart, based on daily chart, we are looking at this correction. We mentioned we need to see the, we're looking for the reversal. If the price, uh, and we the break out of 1.42, we're looking for 1.65 following by 1.97. This is the targets we're looking for. Right. The only things I need to highlight here, if you get any opportunity for buy based on lower time frame as a reversal, we will take it. And uh, but the one thing I need to highlight that if the price is not reversing or is not moving in our direction as a fast, if it turns to a corrective move based on lower time frame, we should know how to manage the trade. We are not going to keep the trade without the stop loss because still we can expect that this one retest the previous low before we get the reversal. All right. This is one thing we need to, I mean. In the bigger picture, at least we should know how to look for the trade based on lower time frame if it's not moving our direction. Anyway, we move to lower time frame, one hour chart, any trade for buy, we'll take it. Again, this is the targets we're looking for. In this case, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.